hey guys what's up today we are going to design a transmission travel like this in a uh, stage pro it is used for uh, transmission power and uh, for mobile networks towers also so for this start your stage pro open new project select a space name the project whatever you want i'm going to name this transmission tower td okay need select your units meter and kilonewton next finish okay then uh, click on edit go on exit plane i am consider 14 by 14 14 by 14 okay okay select the front view sorry top view okay select and uh, draw end to end a uh, beam end to end beam okay then unselect again go select like this draw again and select select follow this processor until we reach the center point okay i am i am assuming the height of our tower is 35 meter okay so we need to take this structure of 35 meter of heights okay 35 meter height means this is our center point okay this is our center node we need to take it of 35 meter heights right then select this structure okay move y direction 5 meter then select this move y direction 5 meters select this move y direction 5 meter select this move y direction 5 meters okay select this move y direction 5 meters select this move y direction 5 meter and uh, select the node cursor select this node move y direction 35 meters okay i'm going to show you in 3D view C. Okay. 5, 10, 50, 20, 25, 30, and 35. Okay. That's why I have mix make the part of 5, 5 meters. Okay. So now I'm going to join all these structures. So select the add beam. Select all all this in a linear manner okay like this like this here yeah. i'm doing same okay just like this in a linear manner not a zigzag manner okay we will do zigzag also but firstly select in linear manner okay fine go to select the beam cursor and uh, delete this bottom only bottom these four 
we do not need this okay now go select the bottom view and again select add beam now provide cross support for better stability okay I am going to provide the cross support okay provide the cross support like this in all the four direction It is better to provide cross support for better stability of structure because this is 35 meter of height structure wind load is very high that's why we are providing extra beams for beams means ism beam beams okay angular type angle beam of ms steel so select all these in a such in a zigzag manner also okay so the load can be transferred top to bottom safely okay that's so can so we can save our structure for any kind of load here we will consider only self weight of structure because self feed is more than any other okay so complete okay complete go in isometric view see complete okay now select on general go on support create fix support right click on support go on front view select bottom four nodes okay assign to selected nodes go on specification sorry go on material select steel go assign to view assign fine then go on uh, property click on section da database wait some time oh. here the american code is selected so go and select our indian code see here indian and i'm going to provide angle okay and i'm going to provide angle size of 200 200 by 25 mm okay select add and close select the angle size go and assign to view assign fine see in 3d view see it is complete okay now we are going to add some load click on load load case details add load case 1 add close click on load case 1 click on add self aid add close click on self aid click on assign to view assign here fine we have done so let's check for zero error click on analyze and print add close click on analyze run analyze save see zero error zero warning zero notes okay so now we can design it click on design select our code here is is 800 okay 
click on command check click on check code click on take code take off add close okay click on check code go assign to view assign yes click on still take off click on assign to view assign yes fine again click on analyze and print no print add click on analyze click on run analyze save see again zero error zero warning and zero notes click on go to post processing mode done okay see click on check the xcl force this is the xcl force click on cl force in y direction this is the cl force in y direction okay click on cl force in z direction this is the cl force in z direction you can see by pressing control you can see in enlarged view okay you can see torsion this is the torsion okay bending moment in y direction this is the bending moment in y direction bending moment this is a in z direction okay beam stress you can see this is the beam stress okay click on reaction okay this is the support reaction x y z mx m y m z okay click on displacement okay this is the displacement of our structure okay click on animation okay this is animation so we have designed the transmission tower of a 35 meter of height successfully you can see in 3d also see this is our tower that uh, we have designed okay so that's all about this transmission tower in a uh, state pro Thank you for watching. Stay tuned. We will come with a new video. Thank you.